Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, you guys are seeing me order a new MacBook. That's right, I'm buying a new MacBook. Anyway, I'm buying the 2015 MacBook Pro 13 inch with the touch bar, making some upgrades. Upgraded from 8 gigs of RAM to 16, and then from an i4 or i5 to an i7. Yeah, I have a pretty old MacBook, not old, but a 2015 one. So I thought I'd upgrade and give myself a new one for college. Then, with the days following my purchase, I just slept, woke up, ate, and then I sat, waiting for when it would be delivered, and it repeated day after day until... Three weeks later. This was actually filmed today. I woke up and it was supposed to get here at 10.45, but it got here early. It got here at 9.45, a whole hour early. And then I struggled to open the door because of how excited I was. So I had to ask my cousin. And then I forgot how heavy the box would be because this is a metal laptop, basically. And so I almost broke my nail bringing it in. And when I brought it in, my cat was like, oh, what's this? And yeah, he wanted to see my laptop too. I was so excited it was there. And yeah, I just, I was just too excited. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is a really exciting video because I got a new laptop. That's right, I got a new laptop. This was my old laptop. This is a MacBook Air um, 13 inch from like 2015. It works pretty well besides the fact that the battery runs out in like 30 seconds. So I'll charge it to like 100% and then all of a sudden it dies. It was time to get a new laptop. Funny story while I'm unboxing this or attempting to unbox this. I actually ordered the MacBook Pro 13 inch 2019 version, but I ordered it end of April, I think April 28th, and then that was like borderline when the new MacBook was supposed to come out in 2020 MacBook. So Apple emailed me one night and they were like, we upgraded you to the 2020 MacBook. So the title is not clickbait because they did upgrade me for free because originally it was like 2,300 and something dollars. But then when they upgraded me to the 2020 version, it was only 2,000 and like, $39. So it was free. It was $300 cheaper than what it would have been. I got this package delivered this morning and I waited till now and it is 3.43 to open it because I went to film it. This is... Look at this beauty. My old laptop's just watching me unbox the new one knowing it's gonna get replaced. Uh, how... Beautiful. Let's let's get some B-roll in here. Cute B-roll music. Wow, they have a cool sticker thing to do this. Wow, innovative. Let me not drop this on the floor already. MacBook Pro. Let's. I'm keeping the box for sure. Look at it. It's so beautiful. I got space gray one because I have, what color is it? Space gray and this isn't the other one. The lighter gray, this one already. So then I was like, wait, it's smaller than this one. And then this is, what is this? The charger? Why is the charger so small? Let's go through the box first, I guess. I have the charger and then designed by Apple in California. Cool. They give you dark gray, space gray stickers instead of the light gray ones now. So I'm gonna put this aside. Charger. Wow, this is a really big charger cube. And I think that's it for the box. So it's a new MacBook. It doesn't have the normal USB port thingy. It only has micro USB ports. There's a thing on my foot. I had to buy an adapter and I'll insert a picture of what the adapter I bought looked like. It's pretty cheap and it comes with like a bunch of things. And plus, it doesn't have an SD card reader, so Apple made their own and they're trying to make me go poor. I'm trying to make this a satisfying shot, but like I can't tell what's happening, so. <sighs> you know what? I'm not good at this satisfying stuff. We're just gonna. Whoa! It's so pretty. What way does it open? Oh, this way. Let's open it. Look at that. <gasps> it's on! Wow! Let's set it up, shall we? So I don't really know how people do unboxing videos and make it entertaining because I guess this is the end of the unboxing video. Since this video is like two minutes long, I'm going to also customize the laptop because why not, right? I'm gonna fast forward the setting up process because I feel like a majority of people know how to set up technology. So 
So now it's a couple hours later. I'm going to customize my laptop because I got everything set up and then figured out some issues that were going on. So I didn't know about this before, but I watched some videos and they included the sticky note thing. And I think it's pretty cute. So you go to your launch pad and there should be... This is here. But there should be a little thing and it has the word stickies. So you click on that. And then since I already have a sticky note up, you just go to file and a new note will pop up. Type whatever you want. You can change the font. There's a whole bunch of font. I use the American typewriter in light so it's cute. And then you can also change the color of the sticky note. I changed it to gray because it matches and it just looks better. Yeah, but you can change it to blue if you want it. Pink. And then now we're going to do folder change. Since I like corgis, I'm going to go to Google and search up corgi PNG. And as long as they, oh, I wanted cartoon. Transparent. Cartoon Corgi PNG. Save image. Then you just save it in here. I'm going to save it underneath a tag so that it's easier for me to find. And then... That was a water bottle. Alright. And then, now you just go to folder. Oh, wait, no. Now you click on this. Control. Click. Get info. And then that. And you just get the picture. Copy the picture. And then paste the picture in. But, some laptops, I know that... Um, I've seen people do this and it worked for them doing the copy and paste method. But for me, it doesn't work. As you guys can see, it comes up as a JPEG folder picture thing. So you just click on this picture, double tap, Command A, and selects the whole picture. But I don't know if this is an actual PNG file. So we're just gonna do that and then see if it works. So it's not PNG file. And if it's not PNG file, it's okay guys. I got you. Don't worry. You just click on the cropping tool and go to oops, smart lasso and you just trace it just trace the dog or whatever you have yeah some parts are gonna get cut out but it's fine because it doesn't really matter so trace it and then once you do that Click crop, it'll convert it to a PNG file. So you're like making, oh, I missed his head a little bit. Oh well, whatever. So then you're gonna command A and then copy it, command C. You're gonna go here, command V, and then boom, it's a cute little corgi thing. And that's how you change your folder icon. All right, next, changing your Google image because right now my Google image looks like this, plain old boring. So we're gonna go with the corgi theme again, corgi, Oh, cartoon. Cartoon, sorry, I just... Cartoon corgi gif. Gif, gif, I don't know. And let's do... I'm just gonna scroll to I find one. Oh, this one's cute. <laughs> corgi bot. Alright, so we're gonna save image as. You're gonna change the name. So corgi.png. So you're gonna change it to .png and then I'm just gonna tag it real quick. Use PG. And then now you're just gonna go upload from device. And open. And now you have a custom wallpaper. And it's cute. Alright, so next. To change your laptop folder, not folder, <laughs> your laptop color, just go to system preferences, general, and then these are the accent colors. And you just you can change it. So now this is pink instead of blue. I'm gonna go gray because I don't know, I like that simple, plain look. And now, we'll do the wallpaper last. Dock, so for your dock, you just go to System Preferences, and then you go to Dock, click Automatically Hide and Show the Dock. And now, the dock won't show unless you scroll your mouse down here and then it comes up. And it makes it look a lot cleaner, a lot nicer. So you guys know that the MacBook Pro, they have the touch bar here. And I want the cute little pet here. So I'm going to show you guys 
how to do that. Go to Google Chrome or whatever extension you use and search up Touch Bar Pen. And then the first thing is by Grace Avery. So you're just gonna go on that and you're gonna download it. And look at all these cute things you can do with it. Like you can pet it, it poops and all this stuff. Yeah, I think it can die. So I'm gonna try not to get mine to die. You're gonna download this. And then once it's downloaded, you're gonna open it. And now, look, my egg is hatching. Do I tap it? Oh, it's hatching. Can you guys see? It hatched. Now I have a cute little cat. How do I how do I feed it and stuff? Oh yeah, be happy. Okay, so next I'm gonna show you guys how to make like one of those collage wallpapers that I see a lot of people have. Alright, so to make the cool wallpaper collage thing that everybody has, I'm gonna use Pick Monkey and it's free. You guys can go on Pick Monkey, select like make create, start creating, or something like that. And then it takes you here, and you wanna use the size 2560 and then 1600 pixels and then you just make a collage basically so like go on google download a whole bunch of images that you like or like fits your aesthetic and then and you just put it here i'll show you guys when i'm done it's been like half an hour or even an hour but i finally finished making it and i made it a beige theme because that's what i really have been liking recently beige and like more neutral colors and i included a lot of palm trees because i love palm trees if you haven't seen my instagram post on instagram at the asian bee haha <laughs> slight plug i went to florida the first time i saw a palm tree i ran up and hugged it and um it was in a random person's yard then i typed love yourself more because i keep forgetting to do that it's hard but i'm trying to work on it and then there's a little cat there's a little cat in a washing machine because i just thought it was cute and i love animals this is it i'm gonna save it and set it as my wallpaper so I hope you guys get creative with this and make your own because it's really fun. I decided to change the corgi folder files to little coffee cups and I used this website that I... F Oops, no, not FaceTime. Her website is called Julia K. Christ. Christ? I, I don't know. And then just go to her desktop icons and then she has a bunch over here. I downloaded this one. So cute. The next day. Hi guys. So right now you guys are behind my steering wheel thing because I'm about to drive to my boyfriend's house to give him his new MacBook. It's not new, but it's something. So I didn't want to resell this because the battery is basically dead and I can't sell it for that much anyway. So I'm just going to give it to him. Yeah, so now we're going to go on our way to drop it off to him. Safe and protected. I'll talk to you guys when I'm there and show you his reaction because recording and filming and driving is not safe. We made it. Now we just wait for him to open the door. Open, please open the door. Don't I surprise you? I already knew you were getting yeah. into it. <laughs> open it. A dog. Yay, let's go. You sound so unenthusiastic. Let's go. Wow, an avocado. You flip it over like I did yesterday. Are you a pancake? <laughs> Yeah, my very brand new MacBook. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that basically wraps up the video. Laptop has been unboxed and customized. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys found any of these tips helpful and if you used it to customize your own laptop, give this video a like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram if you want to see a picture of me hugging a palm tree. Anyways, I'll see you guys on Tuesday.